So this visit was completely unplanned. Uh, my friend and I were in the area and we just decided to drop in and see what plants they had offered. I love the combination of small leaves and thorns on this one because it was kind of like a combination of cute but also fierce. And here is a very tall unicorn cactus. It looks like it's been through something. Now this pot and plant combo was just perfect. So I saw this ribbon and I decided to check out this plant and it wasn't hard to tell why it was the winner. I mean, those tufts, that perfect symmetry. Like with so many other plants, I was so tempted to touch this one, but I had to resist. So this table started off with some cacti and it just keeps going because this is a cactus show and there's more. These cacti were really cute. They looked so perfect that they almost looked fake. And this one kind of reminded me of peaches with the rosy hues and kind of the muted colors. I thought these kind of reminded me of fur cones, um, but my friend commented and said they actually reminded her of shampoo ginger that she saw on a video one time. Here's another furry one that I was also tempted to touch, but I could not. And of course, here was the winner's table with the plants that were either the prettiest or best staged. Here's another cute one with also very tiny leaves. I am obsessed with Haworthias, so seeing this white one literally made my day. I've also been in love with Conophytum and Lithops for many years now, so seeing this little arrangement also made my day. Fun fact, I used to put this one in and out of my Etsy shopping cart a number of years ago. Never bought it, but love to see it. Here are some more of my favorites. I think these look like stepping stones from a fairy garden just because of their colors and how compact they are. And of course there were some crochet items. I crochet, so this was really fun to see. Next up was the Andromiscus succulents with their bubbly leaves and plump texture. I love these ones just because they are so smooth and just come in so many varieties. Like look at them, they come in all sorts of shapes. There was also more to this table including some Haworthias and some of those leafy things that look like Phytonias but they're not really. And there was another table for Haworthias including this beautiful variegated specimen and some other really large ones too. And then there were these weird sea and urchin looking things. There's more conophytum at this table, but they're all in clusters. This plant just threw me off. Like the textures were just a little weird. Last but not least, a massive astrophytum with my thumb for scale. So that marks the end of my little commentary of this event. I kind of ran out of interesting or creative metaphors halfway through to describe the plants, but hey, I hope you enjoyed it. So let me know what else you'd like to see, and this event happened a long time ago, but it just took me a long time to come up with what to say and the editing. So yeah, like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.